So it's been a while since I have had one of these chat to the camera videos, but I felt like it was time for an update for anyone who cares, which is probably not gonna be a lot of people. So I'm now completely finished with my PhD. So technically I am a doctor. I am still waiting for that piece of paper that tells me officially, but for all intents and purposes, I am now finished my PhD. However, you may realize that I am still in my office. And the simple fact is that I am still employed by my supervisors. So I still have duties over here. So for example, publishing papers, still doing some research. I'm not sure how long this will go on for, but for now I will try to stay with my supervisor as long as possible. My supervisor and I, we have gone through a lot together. He's very helpful and I wouldn't do a postdoc with anyone else apart from my supervisor. So I'm kind of clinging on to the fact that there will be some funding in the nearby future. So technically what I'm doing is being a postdoctoral researcher. However, I don't have an official seating or like an official position, but technically I am still researching, still publishing papers. So I'm using that title for now, postdoctoral researcher. So there's been a few changes in the whole YouTube thing. So so I've actually made a new channel which focuses just on finance videos. I know I have been posting some finance videos on this channel and I feel like a lot of people do not watch that kind of content and I really respect that of course because this channel wasn't intended to become a finance channel but as of recently I have really been into finance and I do truly believe that finance is one of those things that we should learn more about and take control of our lives with it. If you do want to check out my finance only channel I'll put it in the link in the description down below. Currently I've been doing daily uploads on this finance channel so I already have around six videos. I've been doing daily videos on that and I am loving it. I only have four subscribers but the process of having a new channel and all the challenges that come with it I don't know why but I find it incredibly incredibly enjoyable. I remember this channel when it was under 1,000 subscribers and it really is the most difficult thing in the world getting from zero to 1,000 subscribers especially within a year in order to get monetized but I've realized that I do not care about the money side of YouTube. Yes it is nice to get some extra amount of money but who cares I really only care about the numbers. I really like looking at the stats and seeing more people watching my videos I don't really care about the monetary side of that that's why I thought I might as well make a new channel go through the process of getting monetized again and make my life a challenge once again that being said I am still going to be posting videos onto this channel just not as frequently as before I do really like making videos both finance videos and these kind of videos so hopefully on this channel there'll be a lot more videos about the PhD career sides of things hopefully some collaborations with some other creators that I've met on the internet and generally this channel is going to revert to again once again back to kind of life advice type of video self-improvement kind of type of videos where I want to give you some entertaining videos that will help you get the most out of your life not just necessarily just finance based which a lot of you do not completely appreciate and I completely appreciate that too because finance for some people is a tough subject to actually comprehend or to actually accept if you guys have any recommendations of any kind of videos that you want to see or any suggestions of any kind of videos that you do want to see in the channel, please comment down below because I'm going to be looking at that, responding to everyone, and hopefully it will inspire me to make some content based on what you guys want instead of what I think you guys want, which I could never actually predict. I am not afraid to be very random and very experimental on this channel because I don't really care about the long-term growth of this channel. I don't really care about the numbers. I didn't care about it from the beginning. I've always said it like I don't really care about how many subscribers, how much money this channel makes. It's never really been about that. If it was about that I would have quit so long ago. It's been like nearly two years of so many hours a week and there's no way that money that I have earned from this channel has even come close to paying back the value that I think my time is worth. I am looking forward to your comments and as always, thank you for watching.